Each one of Gatekeeper's envelopes can be triggered by a different note by using the MIDI Learn button. This is Sam from Polyverse with a little tutorial on how to do this in Gatekeeper. Let's get started. First, insert Gatekeeper on an audio track. Then, create a MIDI track and send its output to the audio track that you've inserted Gatekeeper on. Now that we're inside Gatekeeper, let's take a look at the MIDI Learn button, which is the button that looks like a piano at the top of the plugin window. It's worth noting that the MIDI Learn button has three states. Learn mode, which is when the button is red. This is when Gatekeeper is able to learn MIDI notes. Active mode, which is a solid color corresponding to the envelope color. This means Gatekeeper will react to the learn note you've set in learn mode. And off, which is when the button is hollow. When this button is turned off, Gatekeeper will react to any MIDI note, rather than one you've manually assigned or learned. Inside Gatekeeper, set up your envelopes. For this video, I'll be using envelopes 1 and 2. Then, disable the envelope trigger button for each envelope. This will make it so that Gatekeeper does not automatically cycle through these envelopes. In envelope 1, select the MIDI Learn button so that it turns red, putting it in Learn mode. Then play your desired triggering note using your controller. I'll use C4 on my MIDI keyboard. After you've played the triggering note, you must then click the MIDI Learn button once more to lock in the assignment. It should now be on Active mode, which is a solid color. At this point, that one note will still trigger both of your envelopes, which is normal, but as we continue on, that'll change. Let's switch to envelope two and repeat this process using a different MIDI trigger note, being sure to first click the MIDI learn button so it enters learn mode, then play your desired MIDI note, I'll use D4 for this envelope, and third, click the MIDI learn button once more to lock in the assignment, ending on active mode. Now when I play C4, Envelope 1 will be triggered, and when I play D4, Envelope 2 will be triggered. You can do this with all 8 envelopes, which makes it extremely easy to incorporate various rhythms with ease. We hope you enjoyed this video, now go have some fun modulating with Gatekeeper.